We're walking to the beach. We're walking to the beach. Walking to the beach. Walking to the beach. Walking to the beach. I am walking to the beach still. Um, I decided to do this whole vlog thing because I need an excuse to talk to myself in public. And yeah, so I was already judged by hipsters. Um, I think because I'm wearing a Roxy sweatshirt. You know, I'm in California. Sue me. Actually, that's what people in California do. But, I don't know. There's someone there. I'm going to talk to you there. I feel really awkward. Back my Starbucks. Pumpkin spice latte. Hey, hey, hey. And I'm fat. You know, watching the calories. Oh my gosh, this park has a dragon, like, crawl through tunnel thing for kids. This is really cool. Like, oh my gosh, I think that's a shark. And the octopus, what? What paradise did I discover? Oh look, there's a dog. Wait, how do I fix with this? I can't. I'll come back. Oh my god. There's an octopus. Then I think that's a shark. And then there's a dragon. And I feel really creeper because I don't want to go on video to kids by myself with my Starbucks. There's the Olympic Mountains in the background and we're going to the beach. But there's an octopus slide. I really want to go on the octopus slide. Maybe when there's less kids around. There's a lot of dogs here too. Barking at me. And there's a dragon. That's a freaking cool dragon. I guess you like crawling it? I don't know. I might have to go explore that in the late evening. Okay. Dude, look at those gnarly waves. Man, I wanna go surfing. Just kidding. Although I think I have the skill level to surf those waves. Cause I think I would suck at surfing. That's why I had moved out to California. Really. This is a beach. It's a little more pebbly than the ones I guess I'm used to. Um, there's a lot of dogs. There's houses. Right on the beach. There are boats. It's still more of a harbor. I think it's actually a bay. <laughs> Yay! My lack of Oceanography, correct terminage, terminology. Now I'm just making up words. Uh, boats, 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 boats. And then we're going in the distance, the uh, Olympic Mountains in Washington. So we're really close to the seats. So it's like I've escaped, but I haven't. The birds, I really thought that was a person. Yeah, it's kind of weird talking to yourself, but at least I have, like, a phone device that I'm talking into, and I'm walking in mud, I'm going to trip and fall right now. Um, look, dog paws, dog paws. I have no dog. That'd be cool. I think that it would be more socially acceptable if I was to walk in dog. Oh, man, it just smells lovely over here. It smells very sulfury. Um... We're just going to keep walking. Into the mud. Maybe not. What else? I don't know any funny jokes. Except uh, this is my, my evidence, I guess. That I like long walks on the beach. Except it's not that big of a beach. Uh, yeah. So, it's very pretty nice afternoon lining. Earlier there was like a group of teenager, older teenager stoners. Pretty sure they were smoking marijuana. Um, yeah. Must be nice. Living the chill life. Um, yeah. It's kind of funny listening to their conversations. Uh, let's go investigate what these birds are doing. This is really not that interesting. I am sorry to whoever's watching this. 
very sorry that you uh, gave up a few minutes. Who knows how long this will be. Looks like someone left their lunch. And a bunch of crows are attacking it. So, yum. Maybe I can pick up some dinner. Um, I don't mind leftovers. Ooh, it kind of looks like chicken. It is. It is Kentucky Fried Chicken. But it looks like the crow raven things that are now staring at me weird. Mmm, dinner. Too bad they ate it all. Hmm. I think it's time to turn back now. Water. House for sale. New price, too. Maybe that new price is like $50. That'd be nice. I could afford it. People just ran by. I was about to start talking to myself. And then I heard runners. Wow. Now a bee is attacking. Send help. Go away, Mr. Bee. Oh, it's just the sand bee. I'm a chicken. I'm watching you. I'm watching you, bee. Maybe it's a wasp. I probably should know. Hmm. It's really pretty out here. The weather is very lovely, um, but I heard it gets worse, as in, like, it actually rains. It's only rained once, um, and it's not sunny all the time. Although that would be nice. I would prefer, I'll, I'll, if they have a comment box, the weather of Victoria, I'll make sure to leave a comment, maybe slip a 20, if the weather could stay like this. I mean, I'm in a sweatshirt, but I'm comfortably in a sweatshirt. You know, stopping skin cancer, covering up. Yeah. Maybe I should move and stop staying on a walk. Or not. Maybe I'll go back and get that KFC. Because that way I'll have to cook dinner when I get back. I might do that. The people started kayaking. I'm guessing that's what they're doing. Canoeing? Kayaking? There's no way to zoom on this, is there? And by trying to zoom, I stop the video. Oh, there's two bros walking my way. Oh no. Let's just listen in on their conversation. I'm a good spy. hear what they were talking about but I'm pretty sure they think I'm crazy because I'm sitting on a log looking at my phone like a hipster is that a big boat Ooh, way out yonder kind of looks like a cargo ship I don't think you can see in here It looks cool. You'll just have to rely on me. The fact that it's a pretty big boat. Or as Nemo would call it, a big butt. <laughs> oh man, I am going crazy. So the only downside of living uphill from the beach is that you have to walk up one of the steepest hills I've ever seen for like roads. You know, not like not hiking, but for road driving um, back up to my apartment. <laughs> so you walk down to begin with. If you're going back up, you have to walk up. And this guy in front of me was trying to longboard up the hill earlier. And it was quite funny. But he stopped before I could fall, which was sad. 
because that was in like fail blog material. And then this would become famous. And then I would make feelings. Oh, he might try again. He might try again. Oh, he's picking it up. Damn. No, but seriously. This title is freaking monster. And it's at the end of my runs. Um, usually my long runs. So on Saturday, this was the, uh, the end of my 12 mile run. So that was gnarly. Um, yeah, this part's not bad. But it gets to the part where, like, you cannot physically run. Yeah, I see people do it. And I feel inadequate. So, yeah. Maybe one day. My legs will be strong enough. But it's already starting to get steep. And it doesn't really look that steep on this camera. That's the thing. But I, I challenge anyone to come run up this hill. I challenge anyone who hasn't already run up the hill. Because people run past me all the time. And I think they're crazy. But of course, there's like no one out running right now. So now I look like the crazy one. But yeah. Man, this hill's a killer. Good thing it doesn't snow much. Because I think that'd be certifiably, sort of like, insane walking up this in snow or ice. Oh, will the motorcycle make it? Will the motorcycle make it? He did. That was kind of anticlimactic. Of course, not a motorcycle's gonna make it. We are now approaching the steeper portion. If you can tell. I don't know if you can tell the slope of this hill, but it, it, coming from the Central Valley, like, this is insane. I'm heavy breathing. I could blame it on the altitude, except I'm coming from sea level, so that would just make me sound like an idiot. Um, yeah. We're almost there. I would run that now if I wasn't in, like, street clothes. Oh, don't enter. <laughs> Man, the cars just zoom up there. See, even that drive the way steep. I love their fire hydrants there. I really want to vandalize it. Doesn't look like it needs a good pair of vandalize. I think so. But then I didn't know if that was, like, allowed. Because it's, like, government property. Man just passed me on the bicycle, looking at me like I was crazy. Man. I don't know where he went. He disappeared. Maybe it's this magical, mysterical hill. Mysterical? That is not a word. It's this magic hill. Where if you ride a bicycle down it, you disappear into another dimension. It's a rift in the universe. Come on, guys. I've been watching too much Torchwood. Almost to the top. Here we go. Feel the calves burn. But that's just where we came from. If you can tell, we are just at the water. Like, five minutes ago. So it's kind of cool being close to the beach. Um, especially when the weather is very lovely. Yay, we made it to the top. Woo! So what did we learn on today's outing to the beach? The beach is like five minutes from my apartment, so that's nice to know. Um, people are looking at me. Um, Canadian children cry the same way American children do, so a North American constant. Um, there were a lot of screaming toddlers and babies, so that was fun. Um, it's really pretty. Not much surfing action going on. Check. Nope, that. Don't bring my board down. Um, crows really like Kentucky Fried Chicken there. There's Kentucky Fried Chicken in Canada. We, we found that out. What else? Um, people think you're hipster if you wear, or hipsters will judge you if you wear a Roxy sweatshirt. Um, the people in Starbucks are funny. And we'll keep you entertained. That Starbucks is really adorable and has a nice patio seating. Uh, the beach has awesome, uh, playthings. They have a dragon, a really cool octopus slide I really want to go on, and a shark whale thing. 
slash fish. I'm not quite sure what it's supposed to be. Obviously artistic interpretation on that one. So, yay, now we're back home, if you can see. And beach outing over. Back to uh, go and find some dinner. Because, well, the crows got to the chicken. Um, and studying. Yay! Bye!